Now to Zamfara State, Governor Dauda Lawal has presented 19 operational vehicles of police to enhance security in the state. The governor says despite the challenges, security agencies are rising to the task of making Zamfara one of the safest. Theophilos Darufai has the details. Since assuming office in May 2023, security remains top on the agenda of the Lawal's administration in Zamfara State. In search for an end to banditry and kidnappings, Governor Lawal met with service chiefs, national security advisor and other heads of security agencies. Though there are still pockets of attacks and kidnap for ransom in some areas, despite efforts by governments and security agencies to cop the menace. While presenting 19 patrol vehicles to the police to enhance security, Governor Lowell is optimistic that the insecurity bedeviling the state will soon be a thing of the past. Security has always been the priority of this government. We're distributing these Tacomas mainly to the DPOs as a first step. We're making efforts to get more vehicles that will be provided to the police. We will try and maintain these vehicles across all the local governments so that that body will be taken off you. The Zone for the Commissioner for Security and that of the police says the gesture is a moral booster for troops and will redouble their efforts in keeping peace. Our Excellency travel far and wide within the country and outside in order to make sure that this security problem is being solved. We can see from here that his zeal, courage and determination to stop activities of bandits in Zamfara State need not to be overemphasized. He said it before, he has mentioned it, he reiterated it, and he has shown it expressly manifested in the prohibition of these vehicles for the police that he is not going to compromise with bandits. That one is a no-go area. We will continue to fight them until when they are totally defeated. Governor Lord also appreciates the sacrifices of troops and assures them of improved welfare packages. You'll agree with me that we are not doing well for our police officers, despite the fact that they risk their lives to make sure we sleep. They are one of the most neglected security outfits in this country. What I'm doing right now is to come up with some form of reforms that will take care of our police officers. With the distribution of these patrol vehicles to the police, it is expected that highways and communities in the state will enjoy relative peace. Tiflas Darufai, TVC News Guso.